we see the mayor checking in. Look, man, them gas prices are high. But I come over here to see my man Mon at the Chevron. And then I go to my favorite spot and get some seafood, some Mexican food, the good old pescado. So I got Dwayne on the camera today. We about to walk in, see what's going on, and see what the chef has got cooking. And I can tell you what, that sun cooking out here today is about 93 degrees in Key West. But as long as we dodging hurricanes, it is all love. So let's see what they got going on over here. There he is. Chef, that's you? There he is. Chef in there working hard. Say hello to the people, Sean. Oh. Hi, guys. So, Miss Jen, look, Miss Jen is in the building. There she is. Miss hey Jen, there, what you everybody. doing around these parts? Uh, I was kind of starving and thought this might be the best place to stop and have a quick lunch and well, a delicious lunch. Yes, and uh, you know, them gas prices are very high. And I like coming out here. Chevron with the Mon family has been here for about five uh, generations of, of conks. They give you the best prices. But then we got to hit the Pescados right here in the Chevron on Truman. You can't you can, uh, beat it at all. And uh, great food. And I think the chef got a little something cooking. Talk to him, Miss Jim. Well, I just went and talked to chef and asked him to surprise us with something that we haven't had before. And I know one of the items is going to be red royal shrimp blackened over a nice green salad and then he's going to do some sort of surprise um wrap okay and i don't know what's going to be inside of it okay it's, but i guarantee it's going to be delicious okay. everything we've ever had the thing i'm loving about the pescado here on truman is that they got to expand the seating and i like these chairs you know uh, i'm not a uh, a spring chicken However, I'm still spring breaking, so I got to protect my back. And the other day, I, I'll be honest with you, I was over at the house. My house has got a nice little odor. So yeah. I was almost in the mood to bust a couple of uh, windmills like we used to do break, uh, break dancing days. So I got to protect that back. But I'm loving this expanded uh, seating area. It's all love. And I got to tell you, so many events in Key West is hard to keep up with. But I'm really excited about this freestyle weekend party get, uh, getaway that's coming up the weekend of September 30th with some freestyle groups. It's gonna be fabulous. You can buy a package and come all the way down to Key West and enjoy about four or five acts. We're gonna have some more information. Boop, boop. Hit the subscribe button right over here. If you like the video, hit the like button. Boom, and it's all love. Miss Jen, I gotta tell you, boy, today is, uh, I was just telling Mr. Duane on film that it's uh, very hot, however, as long as we dodging hurricanes in the city of Key West, we're doing well. Knock on wood there. What you drinking in? I'm drinking a Mountain Dew Code Red. Okay. Hits the spot, pulls okay. me down. So you like Mountain me a little Dew? energy. I love Mountain Dew. Mountain Dew is great. Uh, people do a fabulous job. And uh, a lot of people doing, uh, you know, I'm doing windmills and some of the skateboarders, they're doing uh, skateboard tricks with the Mountain Dew. But I say you stay high on the red right here. Mountain Dew Code Red, you know. Security, uh, my man Dwayne, we got a S1W code when he had a code red. It's a serious code, so I'm gonna stick with that Mountain Dew all up. So yesterday, I had the pleasure of being in City Hall and finding out what was going on with cruise ships. Whoever told y'all that cruise ships are not coming to Key West, they gave you a fiction uh, statement, fictitious statement that that, that is not, not true. Uh, the other day, I, I pulled up to Key West on Front Street. I seen a massive cruise ship. I was happy to see cruise ships back. I think it's fair and balanced. You know, not a lot of uh, cruise ships a million, but we can't also not have zero. So my opinion, I think somewhere in the middle is okay. And uh, I, th I think we live and die by tourism. If tourism went away, I think uh, I or anybody in entertainment wouldn't have a lot of it. I think you're right. So at the meeting yesterday, did they work out that balance a little bit? Unfortunately, uh, a motion that was uh, addressed for a contract was denied. So we're back to the drawing board because we're trying to find that happy medium. But in the meantime, cruise ships keep uh, coming into Pier B and uh, you know, we'll do the best we can. If you ain't learning by now, if you wanna be in politics or you, in the world, I don't know any, any, any profession or anything that you could do to please all the people all the time. So just stick to what you believe in your heart and go from there. But, Sounds I got to tell you, I'm excited with Chef, with the Chef Got Cooking. 
Pescado over here. Hit the subscribe button. Hit the like button. It's all good. There it is, bro. Just like on the truck. Dwayne, can we see roosters on this truck in the background? So yes, we can. Yeah, we got one right here, don't we? And where are we at, Dwayne, right? What does it say, right? 90 miles to Cuba. Okay, 90 miles. Southernmost point. Also, Miss Jen, I know you're excited. The roosters are excited. It's all love out here in Paradise. Ms. Jen, can you describe to these people your first official Fantasy Fest with the company, Louis C. and Mary Entertainment, when you worked Fantasy Fest last year? How was that? Talk to them right there. Oh my gosh, it was more than I anticipated with a lot less clothing than the parties called for. It was a blast. Um, we did a whole bunch of parties at different venues. Um, shout out to Salty Frog. And sandbar. Um, and sandbar, yeah. and, it was, an, uh, and uh, it was just so much fun. Everybody was dressed up. We saw a lot of the same faces. They enjoyed the party so much that they came back the next night for another party. Absolutely. So hopefully we're going to do a repeat of. Go to Fantasy like Celebrity Parties on Facebook, and we already have all the events up for this year, and it's going to be big this year. We don't. We only know how to do it big. B I G. Rest in peace. We're doing it big for him. So it was absolutely fabulous. Miss Jen, why don't you check in with Chef, see what he got cooking. Actually, I think the chef's chef, about ready? ready. Chef, what we got cooking, sir. Coming up. When Chef come out, it's serious business here at the Pescado. And uh, Chef is no joke. That man is passionate, 100%. Shout out, we got a shout out LL Cool J today on the show. Uh, do, you, do, do they know what LL Cool J stands for? Ladies love Cool Ladies. J. Okay. Chef, come around. So, oh, Chef, wow. Chef, what we got cooking in the kitchen? Talk to him right there. Today, Ooh. guys, I bring you a, wow. a red shrimp royal with salad, blackened and seasoning, with some of our dressings, made, homemade it, with a key lime sauce on it, side, and we got a ranch also. Right here, we got our fish wrap, lemon pepper, seasoning, homemade, and our chipotle sauce right here. Nice. And also, oh, I make for you guys a special one. We got a surf and turf burger with a red oh. shrimp burger. Something Cute. pretty good. You guys can come and check it out anytime right here. So, oh, Chef, fantastic. break it down. Let me explain something to y'all watching worldwide on the channel. Right? When you come down to Key West, I'm going to have Chef explain to you where we at, what times you open. So, like that, you know where to come out here because got to have a plan like when you go to Walt Disney World you know which ride you're gonna pick this that's got right, to be in your right. itinerary so chef where are we at we are right exactly right next to the Chevron guy station 1126 Truman Avenue we are here from Monday to Saturday from 9 to 10. Pescado look it up look up the website check out the Facebook page and chef you got a passion for cooking because every time I know that kitchen ain't easy I mean yeah. I'm sweating just out here <laughs> eating I can imagine in the kitchen so I love uh, what I do you know what do you really enjoy the um, art of cooking and feeding people? Is that in your in your in your heart? In yes. Your, okay. Every every dish comes from heart. Okay. Okay. Every pescado. 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 Yeah. And Jen, you you know chef for a while. Every time we we don't get this much time with chef because he's so busy in that kitchen. It, right. It's serious. So if I want to order, I'm here already, and I want to order. Can you do uh, delivery? Yeah, for okay. sure. Okay. So they just six call days a week. Up. Just call on. Yeah. Three or five. 330-0011. Okay, well, Chef, Fantastic. you're a gentleman Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Jenny. Okay. Enjoy. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. See you later, Chef. So, uh, man, yeah, we got we got to shout out that boy. Like I said, L.O. Cool J, he did it big. We're going to get on another subject another time about that. But it's massive. Massive, massive. Uh, Miss Jen, I think you uh, said that there's some... Uh, Art festival or something? Going? Yeah, I just heard a few minutes ago that there's going to be an art festival right up the street, uh, right up on White Street, near the White Street Pier, this Saturday. So there's going to be lots of local artists right down the street from Pescado. So check out the art fair and then come down here and have a bite to eat. Absolutely. Truman and White, Pescado, man, it's really good. And uh, Miss Jen, a lot of people coming out here. I mean, right now I like to be in the pool. I like to be in the ocean. I don't know about the jacuzzi, because the jacuzzi is hot. I like to be out there parasailing. Land and sea, talk to them. Well, um, one of the things that I love more than anything, if, besides jumping in the ocean or jumping 
in a swimming pool is going sailing. Nice. There is nothing more relaxing and exciting at the same time as being on a 75 or 85 foot schooner going 9 or 10 knots and chasing the sunset and chasing the wind. So I want to do a big shout out if it's okay um, to the Spirit of Independence with Captain Rick Sands and the Jolly 2 Rover with Bill Malone. He's the owner. Uh, they are two of my favorite ships to go out on any night of the week you can give me a call anytime it's jenny sun j-e-n-n-i s-u-n on facebook or you can give me a buzz at 305-923-6749 and i'll set up your reservations and absolutely, i promise absolutely. you're gonna love it absolutely wonderful uh we moving up big out here in production with my man duane we still don't got the, the production credits like in the movie, but we get to that point. So I'm gonna start with me, and then I'm gonna go to you, and we gonna get the titles here verbally. Louis C. the Mayor, for the record, name. And I'm Jenny Sun or Jenny Sheffer. Uh, production on camera. Your name? Dwayne. Dwayne Harris. Okay. AKA S1W. S1W. Please w. subscribe. Do it big, Louis C. the Mayor on YouTube. We going all the way up like Fat Joe. Hi!